As of today, uh, 19th of March, we've had more than 12,000 reported uh, coronavirus infections in Germany. Uh, we've all made certain level of adjustments in our life um, due to the coronavirus and due to this pandemic situation that we're going through. And today in my vlog, I'd like to show three areas where I have particularly made changes in my life. And that is, one is I don't go to office anymore. Uh, that helps me to um, keep myself at home and keep myself away from other people uh, and uh, not use public transportation. And secondly, um, we've been washing our hands uh, throughout our lives. But I think I must admit personally that I'm more aware in how to uh, wash the hands uh, properly now. And last but not the least, I only go out of the house to uh, buy groceries for my house. And today I'd like to take you along on my grocery store shopping uh, and see what's happening there. So till now, um, in where, the region where I live, it's uh, called North Rhine-Westfalen. In Germany, we, don't, we do not have a lockdown as yet. Uh, but until then, we are, we are allowed to go uh, out for the necessities like buying grocery and probably also doing getting out and taking a walk. Uh, these belong to uh, the bread. So people in Germany, we eat a lot of bread. So for breakfast and for evening. And if you see, there are only like very few of them left. And it's all empty. And I'm quite surprised so because in India, they were saying that uh, in Germany, there's a shortage of uh, toilet paper. And I was not believing that because in a pandemic situation like this, I would imagine that we would want to have, we would worry about having food or uh, having our medicines and things like that but it is actually kind of true that we don't have toilet papers and uh, this is the area in Draver where they keep the toilet papers and the kitchen tissues and we don't have any and to be frank before this I had gone to Aldi, Lidl and DM so DM is a, a drogery market and Aldi and Lidl is also a supermarket and this is the third supermarket that I've come and we don't have toilet paper I would request everybody to not buy anything more than what they actually need because I'm not uh, worried because I don't have toilet papers. I would survive or all of us would survive without uh, having them. This is not a necessity but nevertheless I think generally for anything I think we have to be a bit responsible and just don't buy uh, more than what you actually need because that actually causes uh, the problem of shortage of certain things. So yeah. I just want to quickly run through um, what I do. Um, so this is uh, basically uh, what the World Health Organization has said that we have to wash at least 30 seconds. So I take some chalk. And we have to make sure that we are not just washing the inner parts of our hands but also um, the outer parts of our uh, hands and then fingers, everything very thoroughly. It's also important that you dry your hands uh, properly. And yes, now I am allowed. I can touch my face, but nevertheless, it's always better that the lesser we touch our face, the better. I hope you like my vlog today, as I previously mentioned, and as everybody has been saying this. Social distancing is the key to uh, get through this, uh, to get the infections down, to slow the infections down, to slow the whole process down. And therefore, it is the time for us to be responsible now. Be responsible, keep ourselves at home, be healthy, be motivated, protective, and we will get through this together.